they've, they've been fun. They've always been fun. It's always nice to meet fans and um, and get to yeah. I mean, especially abroad. Like I do a lot in the UK, mm. and that's kind of nice. But it's good to come to Madrid and see Spanish fans and get to see them at the show. And yeah, I mean, they're always good fun. It's good to do them with the other boys of the, of the cast as well. Um, yeah, just have a lot of fun. Yeah, basically. Um, great experiences. They're really fun. It's good to see all the fans and meet people who uh, appreciate the work that we're we're doing um, as actors. So it's yeah, it's, it's great. Get a good feeling out of it. Um, it's a little bit strange, to be honest, because. Uh, I, 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 I think as an actor, to a certain extent, it could be one of 50 people who have played that part and you're just lucky enough to be doing that part. So sometimes you're like, do you really like me? It's just because you're like the person, the kind of character in the show and, and that could have been anybody. So if it wasn't me, it would have been someone else. And it's also, sometimes it can be a bit overwhelming because it seems uh, that you don't, it seems undeserving because we're just you know, haven't done anything special to do anything for people apart from being the show, but it is then also really rewarding that people do care about what you've done with it. So it's a weird thing, because you also don't want to get, I think some people can get a bit carried away by the fact that people are like, we think you're great, but if they kind of balance that. Um, and equally, I, I, yeah, it, it, it's really sweet though, it's really nice that people do care. So. One woman asked me to sign <coughs> the inside of her leg here <laughs> and um, with, with a pen and um, my signature and she had very small shorts on and I said okay and her husband took a photo of it, of me signing the inside of her leg. And, she, and I was with the other boys and they, she didn't ask the other boys to do it, she just asked me. <laughs> and it was very scary because she put her leg on the table. Put her leg, and I sort of had to sign the inside of her leg. And she said that she was going to get it tattooed, my signature. Yeah, that, that, that's, that's very strange. That's very weird. <laughs> um, I got once asked, uh, who would I rather sleep with? Um, Gaius or the dragon from, from the show Merlin that I was in. Um, Answer with the dragon, because why not? Uh, you, you gotta give me, you gotta give me time to think about that. I don't, I don't know off the top of my head. Um, no, generally people have been really sweet. I, I, I think sometimes because um, everyone's really, really nice, and it is. I think sometimes it can be a bit, um, a bit awkward sometimes because you don't want to disappoint people. And, and it's important when people come all this way to, to meet you that you don't want to let them down or don't want to be in a bad mood or don't want to be tired or want to say something interesting or funny to them. And sometimes that can be, you feel a bit under pressure to do that because you don't want to, you know, the same way whenever I was younger and I met people or, or any, any stage I met people that I care about, you kind of, you, you want them to, to say something to you. So that's the only thing that, that, that sometimes, um, <clears throat> If you have expectations, you kind of can feel a little bit of pressure sometimes. So, I know that's not a funny anecdote, but that's more of a kind of a, an idea of some of the interaction that sometimes happens whereby if sometimes people are too uh, put too much importance onto it, then uh, you can you can feel okay, just you know. Um, and sometimes you see people screaming and they say they want to faint, and, and then they just can't talk to you, and then, you know, and, they, and you're like, it's okay, we're just having a conversation. So that's, yeah. Doctor Who. I've always been a fan of Doctor Who. Um, always been, always loved the show. Always loved, loved it since I was a young boy. So I've sort of grown up following and being part of the Whovians, I guess. Or you know, I know they don't like being called that, but like being a part of a group of people that support a show, the fandoms. And then I find myself then being in Merlin and having my own set of fans. It's kind of weird because I talk to my fans about how good Doctor Who was. So yeah, it's weird. It's, it's lovely though. Obviously, lots of things. Um, becoming an actor, obviously, I was a big fan of film and uh, various television shows um, and actors in them. So uh, yeah, I've been a big fan of, you know, lots and lots of actors along the years. I've been too long to name any, but um, yeah, lots of inspirations. So yeah, I was a big fan of various TV shows. 
I've always been a football fan and an athletics fan and a music fan. I mean, I, I listen. I, when I walked to someone like Michael Fassbender, I was like, "You're cool, you're cool." So all, all the time, and then you know, so when, when you when you, and even when I go on, if I go on to set or I come to a comic convention and I see somebody like Tyrion Lannister, and I'm like, I really want to talk to him, and we're in the same green room. I'm like, "Can I go say hi?" Or is that weird? And then. So yeah, I'm the exact same when it comes to wanting to meet people. So, and and the only difference is, I end up wanting to take people's photographs as opposed to kind of take and, I, and I'm able to do that a little bit. But it's the same thing. Yeah. Hello, I'm Alexander Vlahos. I play Mordred in Merlin, and I'm here at the KLC event in Madrid. And I uh, just wanted to say, hello, hola, qué tal? Hello, uh, I'm Tom Hopper and I am at WizardCon in Madrid, having a cracking time. Hola, I'm Owen Mackin at KLC Events in WizardCon in Spain and uh, it's been wonderful, I love, I love Spain.